In Game 3 of the National League Division Series, NLDS, the Philadelphia Phillies were no match for the New York Mets, who exploited their weaknesses and won decisively with a 7-2 victory. Sean Manea led the charge, showcasing his dominant pitching that left the Phillies struggling to mount any offense. From the outset, it was evident that the Mets had a strategy to put relentless pressure on the Phillies, and they executed it to near perfection. Pete Alonso quickly put the Mets on the scoreboard with a home run against Aaron Nola, signaling that the Phillies would face a tough challenge ahead. This early lead set the tone as the Mets seized control. Throughout the game, the Mets continued to capitalize on the Phillies' inconsistencies. Jesse Winker added to the Mets' lead with a critical home run, highlighting how the Phillies struggled to defend against pivotal plays. When the Phillies had two runners on base with no outs in the sixth inning, they failed to take advantage of the opportunity due to Manea's excellent pitching. He struck out Bryce Harper with a sweeping pitch, and Nick Castellanos followed with a poorly timed swing that allowed Jose Iglesias to execute an easy double play. These pivotal moments underscored the Phillies' inability to capitalize under pressure. The Mets' strategy was clear. They intended to dominate not only through Mania's pitching, but also by creating a cohesive defensive effort that the Phillies couldn't overcome. Iglesias' quick double play highlighted the Mets' defensive prowess, showcasing the team's ability to stay coordinated under pressure. This effectively neutralized the Phillies' attempts to generate momentum as they found themselves unable to break through the Mets' defense. As Manea continued to dominate in the seventh inning, setting down the Phillies in order, it became increasingly apparent that the Mets had a stronghold on the game. The Phillies made several critical mistakes, which the Mets turned to their advantage with precision. After Manea escaped the sixth inning threat, Starling Marte and Jose Iglesias each added critical insurance runs, driving home two more runs apiece. The Phillies' offense appeared disjointed, unable to counter the Mets' well-executed plays. Their inability to respond effectively to Manea's strategic pitching further highlighted their weaknesses. The Phillies could not find a rhythm in their offensive lineup, which only reinforced their inability to combat the Mets' control over the game. The Mets exploited every misstep by the Phillies. When Manea struck out Harper and induced Castellanos into a double play, it not only stopped the Phillies' rally but also signaled a significant psychological blow. The Phillies seemed outmatched and overpowered as they were unable to generate any lasting offensive pressure. Meanwhile, the Mets continued to exploit the Phillies' weaknesses, securing more runs and maintaining a commanding lead. By the time Manea exited the game to a standing ovation from City Field's fans, the Phillies were already too far behind to recover. The defensive strategy employed by the Mets was as crucial as their offensive plays. The Mets held the Phillies to just two runs, demonstrating how they could leverage the Phillies' vulnerabilities. The Mets' ability to consistently keep the Phillies' offense in check, even when opportunities arose, proved decisive. Throughout the game, the Mets showcased their ability to exploit weak points, prevent the Phillies from gaining any meaningful ground, and maintain a strong grip on the game. Manea's stellar performance was bolstered by an equally impressive defense and timely hitting. As the Phillies failed to adjust, Manea and the Mets took full advantage, systematically exploiting each weakness. The lack of coordination and adaptability in the Phillies' lineup allowed the Mets to dictate the flow of the game. The Mets, on the other hand, showed a level of discipline and unity that highlighted their playoff experience and readiness to close out the series. Mania's pitching and the Mets' ability to capitalize on key moments underscored the Phillies' struggle to mount any consistent challenge.